Why do lug nuts need retorquing? It's all about safety. We'll tell you why next. Lug nuts keep a wheel securely attached to the hub, but they can't perform as designed without having the correct amount of torque applied. During daily vehicle use, lug nuts undergo typical stresses and forces, which can cause a slight shift in the seating of the lug nuts. This sometimes results in them becoming loose or tight. These stresses include the rotational effects of driving, cycles of warming and cooling, and nudges from bumps in the road. The presence of dirt, sand, rust, or grit between the threads of the nut or between a nut and the wheel can also create false torques during the initial fitting. And when this happens, the force applied overcomes the friction but doesn't translate into clamping force. For these reasons, many tire dealers will invite drivers to come back the next working day to have their wheels retorqued. It's a quick procedure, usually offered free of charge, which involves inspecting each lug nut on the wheel to check if they are too tight or too loose. And if the lug nuts are too tight, they strip the fastener threads or stretch the wheel studs. They could also warp the drums, rotors, or hubs. With loose nuts, there's a small risk that the wheel could come off while your customer is driving on the road. The chances of this ever happening are very low, but with safety being top of mind, it's important to take these precautions. The lug nuts are tightened in a specific sequence with a torque wrench to provide the proper torque. The correct order for any wheel with five or 10 lug nuts is a star-shaped pattern. And now a wheel with four lug nuts should be tightened in the shape of a cross. I'm Mary Dallavala coming to you from the Tire Review Continental Tire Studio at Babcox Media. Thanks for watching.